an inquiring mind. Oh, what's up, bro? I ain't seen no black person in a minute. I thought I was all alone here. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for that pure stuff, if you know what I mean. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. Yeah, I'm not really concerned about impressing Professor Weasley, but that pure stuff you're talking about, yeah, I'm with that. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? Yeah, everything you just said, I need all of that so I can make that special brew. <laughs> Gotta stop smoking. What's up, people? It's your boy again, the great one, usual suspect. Today we playing episode five of Hogwarts Legacy. So, without any further ado, let's get into the game. All right, what's up, well, bro? Fancy meeting you here. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? You know, it's my first day here, bro. Since I arrived. Don't act stupid. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Let's go. Following your lead, bro. Is this the courtyard? What is he looking at? I don't want no problems. About to get my new wand, too. Be a problem out here I in these streets. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Sound like you want to see. Speaking deep. of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? Cool. That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Oh, you'd be well. Spend huh? a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. That sounds crazy. Speaking of detention, on, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. I'm trying to Professor steal Weasley some came books. to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Okay, worked out for you then. So, how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, yeah. just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lace wing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Whoa, who's that? My boy keep going? Oh, I... We're gonna run all the way here. Marlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look! What's going on? What are we looking see at? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? I don't see none. You certainly don't see that every day. Castle is gigantic over there. Absolutely. Are we almost Why there? We to the left is the Forbidden Forest. <laughs> Out of bounds towards force? students. Oh, hence the name. Okay. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Oh, we need some bikes or something. What's up with them brooms? What they got them flying brooms? Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? 
A little? It's positively enormous. It is that. Yeah. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. So there you go. Oh, Close the you would like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. No, I've always nice. thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Hopefully. We'll see though. I doubt it. Alright, where is this place? Where are you taking me? Mr. Moon! He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Mm. Hello, Mr. Moon. Well, we Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure! Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me! Eyes big as saucers! What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the about? castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Alright, you do that. A Demi guy. <laughs> I don't what know they what he's putting in his pumpkin hole. juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. He oh, needs is your to sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Right. Was she sick? Was she sick in the head? The evil one. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about oh boy, it. Hat. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Well, we all got those witch hats. Alright, where am I supposed to go? So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Alright. That works for me. Have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Uh, I don't know this place. Whatever. Alright, where do I gotta go first? Trees. Alright, um, right there. Purple arrow. So I gotta go here. Yeah. My first class. Right over here. Nope. Right here. An inquiring oh. mind. Oh, what's up, bro? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating okay. something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spell crafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. 
Nothing like to being back able to, to grow your own ingredients and brew what Not you want when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? I want all the free stuff. Yep. Hot and tape, small potion station. Yeah, I need both these. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. I ain't got no money for none of your goods. I got $30 for a hat. 30 for the scarf, leather gloves, I don't want no glasses. Take the gloves off your hand, get the scarf, and take the hat, just in case. Nah, take it. Why not? Probably don't wear the glasses, but I'll take it. Alright, off to the next spot. Let's see. Um, need the wand. Probably take that out right now. I think I'll use this borrowed wand anymore. I have our own joint. Oh, it's dusty in here. Okay. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for, for a new wand. Yes, <laughs> it's about time. Beard yes, I, slash mustache about time. Is crazy. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold <laughs> Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest Never. wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Mm, powerful core, ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, that like a sniper rifle. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm. Damn oh, it. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Okay. Firecracker one. Well, this Don't isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. <laughs> nah, I don't look like the one either. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Okay. Is there anything special about this? No, oh, okay. You get to customize it. How intriguing. Classic gray. <laughs> Taking so long for the textures to load in. Curious indeed. It was terrible. Uh, not sure. I don't like none of these. How intriguing. Uh, 
we go for that. Nah. Curious indeed. We're gonna go for the ivory. How intriguing. Black walnut. Curious indeed. Mm. One look like shank. How intriguing. So with I don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it like that. Uh dragon. Mm. It's a powerful magic. Unicorn, Pokemon of producing constant magic. It will produce the great range of magic. We want that. I think we want that powerful magic. We want A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Okay, anything else we gotta do? Um, what do you think? Finish. That'll work. About the size of a good knife. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> Let's go. <sighs> Run on the magic, we still stab now, people with it. How did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds Ooh, wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. All right, home. Take it easy. We're looking for the wand. All right. What's up? Mm -hmm. No. The three broomsticks. Do I need broomstick or this pot? <laughs> no pot. Then we need potions. Let's go. <laughs> Now go all the way up. Welcome to J. Pippin's push. What's going on? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. Okay. You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley These sent potions, me to collect son. some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. <laughs> I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, You'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the you most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. Okay, I thought and you had something else. I unveil so. new ones from time to time. 
pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Give me all the free stuff. You know, see it. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory or come back another time if you're in a rush today. What is this? Focus potion. I ain't got no bread for my nails. Yeah, I might have to come back another day. Hold on. Let me get that. Yeah, I'm definitely broke now. Alright, I'm out of here. Post some better work, B. Alright, where else I gotta go? Chill out. Sir, I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin, yes, beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. Mm, so I... I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? Yeah, I suppose not. I'll do. In addition I'll to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let's go. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Mm-hmm. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. Better go and yeah. find Sebastian. I don't have any more money. Alright, you take it easy, bro. We're looking for the free stuff. Alright, where is this? Oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry, up. I think I'm going the right way. What up, cat? <laughs> All right, you can take it easy, cat. I don't know what what that does, but cool. Where's my boy? There you go. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Oh, what's that? Oh, that thing is big. Oh, I gotta fight this big old troll. Yeah, I'll take care of that. I don't want no problem. Oh, it will be a second one. Oh, man. Dodge. 
Hey man, you, you gotta take him out. Oh, let me get out the way. Are we weak? Potato, potato. Potato. Oh, I was gonna take it forever. Oh, we got you. Ooh. Potato, potato. Get up. Potato. Oh, man. Potato, potato, potato. Oh, we keep getting used. Potato. Potato, potato. Bro, we got to use it. Oh, we tried to double tap. Oh, man. Get up, get up. Keep running. Oh, man. I don't like this. Good lord. Oh, man. Yo, get up. Potato, potato, potato. I can't even see it. I don't know what's going on. Oh, man, he struck me. Potato, potato, potato. Oh, I ran out of Ah, oh, man. I ran out of magic. Oh, Lord. Oh, he was me. Am I dead? No. Stuck in the corner, though. Where you at? Oh. Revenge. Oh, use me. Alright, I'm back in the game. Oh man. Yeah, him. Oh. Oh, he got used. Oh man. Where my boy at? Am I by myself? Alright, I hate Oh. He trucked me again. Good lord. Let's go. Let's go. What about you? Come on. Come on. There we go. Keep getting the deep special. There we go. Let's go. Oh, it didn't work. How the hell? Potato, potato. Oh, he switched it up on me. There we go. There we go. I was getting somewhere. Oh, keep trucking. Come on, potato, potato. Come on, we almost out of here. You're trucking me. There we go. Yeah, we about to be out of here. Let's go. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I'm up out of there. What do you mean? Oh. Turn them in the paper. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I no, suppose okay. so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, 
Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Ooh, officer. Yeah. Face Singer. The place, sir. Officer Singer. And thank you again. Some bull crap. Oh. Why can't we dip like that? We had to run all the way here. Oh, hello there. A, a moment if you would. You I'll want? go and see what he wants. What's the problem? I was about to go around the counter. What's the problem? So. So you ain't got nothing to say? I'm about to get up out of here then. Akio! Repairer! Lucky they didn't do more damage. Oh, that was a problem. You need a spot repair. Still ain't saying nothing though. What's your problem, bro? Let's fix the first shot. What's this? Okay. Might as well loot the place while I'm in here, drink your, your little tea. What else in here? Ain't got nothing else for me to take. Fix up this place. Repair it. Unless they can the same one. Destroy everything, man. Turned us into the janitor as well. Me, old boy, and you help. I save the day and become the janitor. Type of mess is this. Alright, is that everything? Repair. Okay, that's gotta be everything. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Uh, Augustus oh. Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own money? glad rags, wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Okay. The Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. See what we got. So you only give me that one roll, huh? Okay. Whatever. Good, let me get a couple things, but all right, I'll take the roll. Let's see. Do we got it? How do I use this stuff? It's X, okay. Here we go. Yeah. 
Anything else? Guess not. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd Charles say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three Sounds broomsticks nice. is just this way. I sell even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined. You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. All right, where we get the butterbeer from? Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Oh. You said oh, you could boy. get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Oh, it seems good about it. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that it goblin doing with seems. Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. You, <laughs> sir. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. You know we want to a bit. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I'll do what I can do. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> Our timeline. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. <laughs> the I'm only here for this one anyway. One my friend me. is enjoying a well earned Only, only. only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Everybody pulled out the ratchets. I said, my friend is busy. But you still can, bro. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come it's gonna be your blood. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Oh, Watch you your know bed. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise no. to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Yeah. That sounds like a good idea. And it's getting dark. We need to go. 
I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another no, detention for getting back alley. after hours. I like to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Peace.